In the latest round of primary voting on Tuesday, President Biden and former President Donald Trump secured enough delegates to emerge as the presumptive nominees for their respective parties. This more definitively kicks off the countdown to what promises to be a bitter and costly eight-month general election campaign. The eventual selection of Biden and Trump as nominees has long been anticipated, featuring a pairing of elderly candidates that many Americans do not favor. Biden solidified his position after winning the Democratic primary in Georgia, while Trump reached the required delegates by winning the Republican contest in Washington state, as reported by the Associated Press. Adding to their victories, Biden claimed Washington state, Trump secured Georgia, and both candidates achieved wins in Mississippi and Hawaii, the Wall Street Journal reported. Democrats also participated in additional voting in the northern Mariana Islands and among U.S. citizens residing abroad. With their nominations secured, Biden and Trump will engage in the first presidential election rematch since 1956. This sets the stage for a race that presents voters with a clear choice between candidates with different approaches to the economy, foreign policy, and contentious domestic issues like abortion and immigration.